Thank you guys for tuning into another episode of War of Divisions. Um, so what we're gonna do today is uh, we're gonna do Guild Wars, and then we're gonna do a uh, one reset of the arena. So we're not gonna do a lot of uh, uh, we're not gonna do too much arena today. Um, and this is because uh, this week I'm probably not gonna push for top 100. Uh, I have to uh, get my wisdom teeth pulled out, so you guys probably won't even see me for a while. Uh, so I'll have to preload some content. But before then, um, I'm just gonna uh, I'm gonna try and see if I can rush top 1,000 arena without using any refreshes. I think that would be interesting. Uh, that would kind of keep me on my toes because then I would have to um, I would have to uh, win all my matches. And my opponent is almost all cleared out here. <laughs> wow. Uh, okay, fine. I'll go with this one. Um, okay, so for Arena, uh, the plan here is we're going to go... Uh, I'm going to run a team that I don't normally run, and that is not uh, meta. I'm going to run a non-meta team that, uh, that I don't normally run, uh, and I hope I can get some decent success with it. Uh, I'll just kind of run fun teams because I'm not looking to rank. Uh, but I will try to keep the bonus character where I can. Come on. Ah, my dog. Uh, he's actually really heavy, even though he's a small dog. Ah, crushing my bones. Uh, okay, let's see. Uh, Gunner versus uh, Gunner team. I have a small advantage over him, but I don't know how that advantage is going to manifest. Okay, yeah, that, that advantage is about to manifest right now into a barrage. <laughs> oh, GG. That, that's just straight up GG. Uh, I think Rosa already used her ability. Oh, that could have been bad. I could have lost Rosa there. Oh, crap, I lost Federica. I was not expecting to lose Federica. That's not good. I could have also lost Rosa there as well uh, if she didn't perfectly evade that. So I kind of underestimated it there after the Fabrica died. Uh, so now I'm kind of crippled too. Uh, that's fine. I get to scout out that last team. Uh, I'm sure if someone's running, uh, I'm sure someone in Guild Wars is running a uh, whole Missile Resist Banquet in, on one of the other teams. Uh, and then they just basically look over uh, yesterday's fights to see who's running all Gunner. And then they'll use that 100 Missile Defense Banquet to kind of annihilate them. Uh, that is one of those uh, funny scenarios uh, where you get to do that. Because uh, Banquet can get 100 Missile Resist. So right now, the the resist that can be maxed out is slash missile and magic. Um, and for uh, slash, there is slash res there's slash penetration slash resist penetration. So slash is act slash resist is actually not the best one. Okay, Rosa's gonna die right there, and he doesn't have the zombie anymore. So that's not good. And I might just die here, but hopefully Nivlu will take someone down with her. Probably not. I'll probably do a despell spread here. Nice. Oh, both of them almost died. That's really nice. Uh, I don't have predictive fire here, and his Federica goes first. Too bad. I kind of wish I had Luarta, because then Luarta might line them up and do a uh, Sidewinder. Oh well. I was kind of also hoping that she had Spider Rain, but the thing with Nivlu is... Um, uh, I didn't, I didn't classify, I didn't split them up because I run several Nivlus. I run one in arena, I run one in, uh, in free matches, and I run, uh, Nivlu in guild matches. So that's not good. Uh, and I, I didn't differentiate them. So that was my bad. Anyways, uh, I have a theory that pretty much any build works up to the top 5,000. So I'm going to run this build right here. Uh, this is a slash based team with, uh, this is a slash based team with Pierce defense. So I'm gonna look for Pierce. Uh, and that's, and we'll see where we go. Uh, but basically it's tank Freyavia with, uh, 
banquet. Uh, I'm trying to, I'm testing out my new bail bargainet to see how well that works. Uh, but for Yevia, her stats is not bad here. Um, it's not great, but it's, it's, it's doable. It's workable. Um, so we're looking at, uh, the, it's the sword resist that's big. Um, we're looking at 40 pierce resists by 64 magic resists. So that means I'm magic immune. However, it's probably a good idea if I switch it to golem instead. Uh, my agion is resist based. So if I switch to golem, I am 65 speed. Thancrit is 40. Okay. I'm still faster than the Thancrit. That's good. That's kind of all I needed to know. And we'll just go ahead and pick somebody. Uh, I'm basically looking for Pierce Resist. Uh, this is an interesting team. This is a free win, so I'm not going to pick that. Uh, I guess I can kind of fight Slash. But I don't want to pick that team unless I have to. Uh, I'm pretty sure I can beat this team. But I don't really want to fight people that are giving me a handicap in the sense that they're not like all not that all their guys aren't wearing gear. Uh okay, this is also a free win. Well, everybody's 1.0 here. Oh hey, it's Wiz. Uh I believe this is no, this is not the same one. Uh there is a guy named Wiz that is uh There's a guy named Wiz that is um a YouTuber and a really strong one at that. Uh, I believe this Shadow Links is Pierce. Oh, it's Ninja. Okay. Think about whether or not I want to fight this team. Um, I might lose to the Frederica, but Frederica's got a Ramu equipped. Uh, all right, you know what? I I'll, I'll fight that. Um, I have Pierce resist. I have I have Banquet for the missile resist. I should be okay. Uh, so no, um, no arena refreshes. I'm basically running. Uh, we're basically doing five runs, and it's five runs, and we're done. So I'm gonna throw in. Uh, I'm gonna put in Guild Wars matches along with it. Hmm. So first turn, uh, Laswell's gonna shield himself and go. Freyavia is gonna draw out magic resists and go. But I don't really need Freyavia to draw out magic resist. Let's see what Freyavia will draw out. Yeah, magic resist. Thancrit will probably go up front. I actually kind of need Thancrit to be... This is kind of awkward because I need um Thancrit to be... I need Freyavia to be first. So that way Thancrit can um buff her. And Freyavia will run up front. Oh, that rough divide missing is big. Uh, Snipe Dagger, okay. Uh, not using her slash attacks. Ouch. Haunting spell right there. All the hate on her. I mean, this is, uh, this is the quote unquote top team for, um, for where we're at, so that's fine. For Yavia, well, he is not doing a ton of damage. Um,. I kind of hope that she would do more damage. Uh, oh, well, that's too bad. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to run Freyavia with Magic Barrier instead of uh, Resist Magic. Not that I'm going to run into any magic to begin with, but uh, that is an option. Uh, I was able to grab Freyavia while Dwayne was out, so I was leveling Freyavia and Dwayne at the same time, and then it just so happened I pulled uh, Luart on uh, my second pull, <laughs> so, uh, but I pulled her midway through the week, so that was, it wasn't as bad. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna have to keep this move on. I'm gonna turn off this one. And this way she should just use Magic Barrier and run up. Magic Barrier gives up to 50% magic resist. Wow, and we still don't have maxed out magic resist. That's fine. I'm not really running her to resist magic at the moment anyways. Hmm. This is a meta build, but it's not a meta build that I'm wor uh that I'm really really cool with fighting. 
Uh, nope. This bill I can beat because I can be 100% magic resistant. But then that's kind of boring. All right, you're the closest person to having a complete team, so we're going to fight you. Uh, I think I have like uh, I think I have a decent chance of winning this. Should be 50-50. Mostly due to the pierce resist and the defense I'm going to get from Thancred. So this Freyavia should be 100% magic resistant on top of having 70 defense on top of having 40 pierce resist. Uh oh. Used the wrong move. I kind of needed her to use a uh, magic barrier instead. Uh, I think that might be holy. That's not good. Uh, which is fine. Here's a taunting spell on all of you. Nice. Ouch. That does a ton of damage. Uh, last one might get killed right here. They're all going for Freyavia. She's probably going to have to take a holy. Ouch. That's fine. Let's see if we can exorcism storm on them. Nope. I think I still have him on Samurai. I wanted to switch him to... I wonder why that didn't work. Okay. But, oh my gosh. Last wall versus two. Didn't he have a... Sh oh, the magic... The barrier broke from the energy buster. Alright, that's a GG. Um, I kind of needed him to have a uh, Exorcism Storm. And the Exorcism Storm didn't go through. So that gives me a couple of things that I need to tweak there. Uh, the Freyavia needs to wear these boots for speed. Uh, you can have these boots. Oh, wait, he can't wear the other boots. Uh oh, that's not good. Uh, I guess he can wear this, but I don't really want him to use the ability. Oh, that's not good. Um, guess I'll just have him use these. Okay, so now he should just run right up, and I need him to have Exorcism Storm. If I had Exorcism Storm there, I might be okay, in the sense that, like, uh... If he exorcism storm Kane and Dwayne, we should be good to go. Uh, not level 100. This is level 100. Hmm. This isn't a good team for Freyavia to fight. Uh, neither is it a good team for uh, Laswell to fight. Uh, uh, what the hell? Let's see. Uh... Uh, really, if I'm fighting this team, I should, um, I should take off, ow, I should take off, um, I should take off Golem and put on Siren for, uh, put on Siren for Rain, because right now I'm negative slash resist, that's not good. Uh, but I should be really strong against, uh, Lucia. Lucia shouldn't be able to do too much to me. Okay, there's the magic barrier, there's the defense up. She should survive a Shining Nova. Holy Night Attack didn't really do too much to me. Blazing Physique. That's not good. Because that means uh, I'm going to do very little damage to him with this Exorcism Storm. That did very little damage. I'm kind of disappointed. Uh, okay, here comes Thancred. He no longer has the Holy Knight attack. Oh, I think that's a Fyraga. Wow, I didn't kill the freaking... That's insane. Uh, I'm surprised I didn't kill uh, Cecil. Cecil is like super glass cannon. I can't believe I didn't kill him. Alright. A win is a win. Luckily, everybody survived. Not the strongest team for me to fight, to be honest, because uh, Freyavia and Laswell both are weak against fire. But it goes to show you that, like, Laswell's damage is very lacking at the moment. Because I don't have a good, um... Ooh, this is a good team to fight. 
Um, Okay, I'm going to show off 100% magic resist. Uh, then we're. The crazy thing about Freyavia is she can get 100% magic resist without ever having to use her ability. Well, uh, without ever having to use any of the abilities. Uh, look at this. Uh, pretty close. Well, I don't really need this one. I can go for. Uh, just leave it as Golem, or I can go for uh, somebody else. And I don't think it really makes a difference. So if she's going to tank everything, he's going to kill him. I don't really need a different card for this. Uh... The Finder full magic team, so... Oh wait, I need to worry about this. I need to give her some spirit, because uh, they have magic swords there. So, let's go back with Castle Leonis. Give her, give him uh, Fenrir. Don't have a good piece of magic to resist armor. I need armor of light really bad. But that doesn't matter. Um This team is super weak in this arena because of the reduction in area of effect. And my Freyavia has 100% magic defense, so I'm not worried about getting hurt by she might not even get hurt at all. Uh, and then just have Laswell kill the other guys. Uh I'll the problem with this team is Laswell is a little too fast, and and Dankrit's a little too slow. So Laswell will actually lap Dankrit, which is not good. Laswell might also lap Freyavia, to be honest. Uh, okay, there we go. Hopefully they will run close enough that Freyavia can hit them with a taunting spell. So this is that that is under the condition of I'm not I, I didn't even use any of my magic things yet. Uh actually I think she might have already used her magic shield. Uh jamming gross. Oh spell artist. Um Freyavia is Laswell's weakness. So Freyavia will outright kill him. Unfortunately, I was kinda hoping Freyavia will get a chance to hit the other two guys with a Blizzaga blade. So that would be cool. There's a water guy. Ian. Oh, Mirror of Equity has some good elevation. Okay, so at that point, that time I actually happened to run into my weakness. Or I happened to run into uh, something that's weak against me. Uh, and that's the thing with the lower ranks, you're likely to for, you're likely to run into any kind of build. Uh, even kind of off meta e builds. Uh, this one's a good one. Hmm, do I want to fight? Well, this is not even evade, so that's interesting. It's not evade. Uh, I'll fight this. Even though I'm not particularly strong in slash resist. At least Siren is for max. She also has max demon wall, I think. Does she have max Siren? Nope, she doesn't have Max Siren, so I guess I guess we're running with Demon Wall here. And the worst thing is my um my Laswell doesn't have a good vision card to go with him. Uh Solidus. That's to kind of make sure I don't die. So this kind of full bruiser setup. Um, zombie Ryu is an issue here. So uh, the plan is who can. It's it's just a matter of whose tank is gonna go down first. Um, 
and he's running mixed damage, so it's actually pretty hard for me to kill him. But he has no healer, so that's the bright side. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not running Freyavia as White Mage, so I have no healing either. But I have a whole ton of shields, so I should be okay. Oh, he has Re-Res. That's not good. Probably should have given Freyavia Re-Res. I think that would have been a better idea. Yeah. Or I can give him... Or I can give her Soul of Thermasa and basically use her as a mage. Oh, well, there's Taunting Spell. Uh, did nothing. Uh, I wasn't really expecting Taunting Spell to do a lot of damage. Uh, that's a really bad Exorcism Storm because I only hit one guy. Holy Bravery did nothing. This is going to be a Slugfest. I think that's regular Stone. I'm surprised the Stone ability did that much damage. So Exorcism Storm right there. Taunting Spell right there. Oh, nice. He died. Nice. Freyavia is taking a decent amount of damage. It's not a lot. Uh, Fatal Bloom. Freyavia is going to go down here, uh, but that should put them into position for another. Yep. There we go. Oh, uh, did the threat drop? Yes, the threat dropped. Good. We're good to go. Uh, now it's just the slugfest with the tank. I uh, probably should have done that first, Laswell. <laughs> if you did, if you did the awaken flash first, you would die. Did so little damage to him. So the key to getting to top one thousand without, uh, I'm wondering if I can get to top one thousand without boost. I'm pretty sure top five thousand is in the bag. Uh. But we'll see. The rewards for top 5,000 is 500. Uh, pretty sure I can get the top 1,000. And it's magic. Uh, and it's magic seals. So that's actually pretty good. All right. Uh, we're going to call it here today. Um, and we're going to see if we can rank up tomorrow. Uh, Hmm, I guess based on the looks of things, I think top 1,000 I might have to do refreshes on. So I might have to settle for top 5,000. Uh, so right now we're here. We should be able to get here pretty easily. Um, if you use any refreshes, I think you can get to the top 1,000 pretty easily. Uh, here, I think if I didn't lose that last one, I might get up there, but we'll see. Alright, thank you guys for tuning in to War of Divisions Arena. Uh, it's gonna be a pretty slow week this week, uh, cause of, uh, cause of the teeth thing. Um, hopefully I can pull for Sakura before I go, go get surgery, so, uh, yeah. Uh, wish me luck, and I'll see you guys, uh, next week, hopefully. Right, have a great day.